Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day so far. My name is Mandy. Thank you all so, so much for being here. Today's video, we're going to be partnering with none other than Rue 21 for this video. I am so excited y'all you have no idea it's a leisure and casual video which is right up my alley if y'all been watching my channel for a while you're gonna know that i am a jeans and t-shirt type of girl i like dressing up don't get me wrong i like you know feeling all cute and stuff and wearing jumpsuits with my hair fixed and everything but on the day to day i like dressing down i like being comfortable i like wearing jeans and t-shirts particularly some band t-shirts so in today's video i'm going to be showing y'all rue 21's brand new denim styles as well as pairing them with some of the coolest graphic tees that i think i've ever seen before ever since i got these in the mail y'all i have been chomping at the bits <laughs> wanting to wear them because i mean i'm just gonna sneak peek sneak peek tlc don't go chasing waterfalls. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is like a dream t-shirt come true. Seriously. I, I'm just like all about TLC. I love TLC. I was a big TLC fan in the nineties and or the early two thousands. And oh gosh. Now I'm getting a little verklempt. So let's just jump right into it. If y'all like this type of video and would like to see more, please consider liking and subscribing. You know, your girl would appreciate it. And without further delay, Let's get into this Rue 21 denim and graphic t-shirt haul right now. All right, y'all, so the first thing that I picked out at Rue 21 is a pair of jeans. I'm also gonna show you the graphic t-shirt that I picked out to go along right with it. And these are the super high rise flare jeans. And when I saw these on the model, y'all, I thought they were so cute. But when I tried these on, when I gave them a chance, oh my goodness, they are just so freaking cute. So this is what they look like. They're kind of a light to medium wash, not quite light, not quite medium. And they have a great super high rise. So they fit a little bit above the belly button, very high on the waist. And they are so stinking cute. I love how these fit. And the best part about these jeans is that they have a very big flare at the bottom, kind of like a bell bottom. They call it a flare. I'm gonna call it a bell bottom because I mean, come on. <laughs> They're so stinking cute, y'all. I could not get over these. So they have really nice big pockets on the back. They have just the cutest design. I love the way the back is styled. So this is what the back looks like. They have these seams right here, right there above the pockets that just kind of cinch you in and give you the nicest shaped booty that I have ever seen in a jean. So, so cute, so well made. And I just love these. They are a fantastic fit. I love the stretch. They feel really good on the body. And the shirt that I picked out to go along with these Oh, so adorable. When I saw this online, I just, I just knew I had to have it y'all. Hello, <laughs> it's Aretha. And this is a really, really nice white t-shirt with some blue tie dye. It's very, very faint. You can barely see it, but it goes really cute with the jeans, the way that they're light washed. It just kind of all bleeds into each other. And then whenever you turn it around, this is what the back of it looks like. So it's very plain in the back. It just has this very faint blue tie dye effect to it. And I just love the way it looks with the jeans. And so, yeah, this is the first item. Um, this shirt is made with 100% cotton. So I do appreciate that. And yeah, now onto the next one. So we're gonna start with the jeans and then move on to the graphic tee that I picked out to go along with it. And these jeans, y'all, are so stinking cute i am in love with these style jeans once again these are super high rise but these opposed to the other ones are not nearly as stretchy and i always consider these to be more of the mom jeans so first and foremost the first thing that i see whenever i look at these jeans right away is this really cool gunmetal button right here in the front i love the way that looks it gives a sort of an edgy kind of an understated feel with these jeans and that's something that i actually really appreciate i also really like the fact that it has functional pockets in the front as well as in the back so the first pair of jeans that i showed you had no functional pockets in the front but it did have functional pockets in the back as well so whenever we turn these jeans around this is what the back of the jeans look like and these are very standard in the back they don't have a whole lot of bells and whistles going on but they do have some really cool details in the front as far as the distressing so they have some holes and things and i just really like these jeans overall i picked these up in a size 20. they fit perfectly they're very snug and that's something that i like about the whole mom jean aspect of them so now we're on to the best part of the outfit and that is the graphic t-shirt and this one is the tlc don't go chasing waterfalls t-shirt and oh my goodness if you were a kid of the 90s if you were a teenager of the 90s like i was if you were an adult of the 90s i think everybody at this point remembers very very fondly tlc i loved them so so much they played don't go chasing waterfalls on the radio. I think ad nauseum at some points. 
I was like, no more TLC, please, no more TLC. But I look back on them and it gives me such fond memories. I mean, what a time to be alive, you know what I mean? And this shirt is so, so cute. So this is a black t-shirt. It's got the typical TLC logo on here. And it's got the whole crew. It's got T-Boz, Chili, and Left Eye. And I mean, yes. Yes, please. I love everything about this. I picked this up in a 3X and it was $21.99. Of course, on the Rue 21 website, you can probably get any sort of coupon there is. They have lots of coupons all the time. Yeah, I mean, what's not to love about TLC, Graphic Tee, I'm all for it. And now on to the next one. All right, y'all, so now we are on to the third and final pair of jeans and Graphic Tee. And then I have a couple of other things that I wanted to show you that I picked up from Rue 21. So these are the third and final pair. And these are actually mid-rise jeans. I didn't remember seeing that on the description of the jeans whenever I saw them online. But when I tried these on, I was actually very pleasantly surprised because they're really not mid-rise at all. They're quite high-rise in my opinion. So they fit right there at the belly button. And I love the way these look. They're very comfortable. They're very stretchy. Plus, they're skinny jeans, but you can't go wrong with skinny jeans, am I right? <laughs> I just love me a good pair of skinny jeans. This is what the jeans look like, and I just love the way these look. I love the copper button right here in the front, standing loud and proud. And these are neither light wash or dark wash. These are right there in the middle, so I would call these like a medium wash. Is that what they're called? <laughs> like a medium wash? Whatever, whatever they're called, they're sort of a medium wash jean. And I love the way these look. They're very comfortable. These are like all around, wear anywhere, do whatever you want to style jeans. And I mean, what's not to love about that? They have functional pockets in the front as well as in the back. And whenever you go down to the bottom, it has a very nice tapered skinny jean. They're quite skinny and they're also quite stretchy, which I also appreciate. And I also got these in a size 20 and they could not fit better. Very, very true to size. I love that. And then when I return these around, this is what the back looks like. So you're not gonna have the big ass small pockets thing, <laughs> which, you know, tends to be like a trend right now. It's like the big old ass, small itty bitty pockets. I'm not down with that. I don't like the way that looks. It almost reminds me of that filter that's really popular right now. You know, the one that I'm talking about, you have this long, big old body, you have the long fingers, you have the long feet, you have the long legs, big torso, and then this little bitty head sitting up on top of it. I think Khloe Kardashian was the one who kind of made it popular on Instagram. What is the deal with that? It's like big old butt, little bitty pockets. I just don't understand it. Why? <laughs> anyway, the shirt that I chose to pair with those jeans are none other than from Death Row Records. Yes, indeed. Whenever I saw this online, I was just like, yes, I have to have that. 1991, I used to listen to Death Row Records and all their artists and oh my gosh, they just had the best music. West Coast rap at that time was just the best and Snoop Dogg and Dr. Dre and who else was in there? Dr. Dre, Snoop Dogg, Ice Cube, I think was one of them. Um, Tupac Shakur, of course. And yeah, West Coast rap was just the best. So I had to get a Death Row Records t-shirt. And this one, once again, is kind of that like that faded, almost a reverse, is it called a reverse tie-dye? I think it is. And then when we turn it around, this is what the back of it looks like. So it has black and it's just slightly bleached, not too much. It kind of has these golds and browns to it. I got this one in a size 2X. I wish I would have gotten in a 3X. I don't know why I got it in a 2X, but I did. It is a little bit more on the snug side. And this one is made also of 100% cotton. Of course, the Death Row Records brand back in the day was this red color. I don't even think they're in business anymore because Suge Knight is behind bars. But anyway, this is the t-shirt that I picked up to go along with it. And now on to the extras. So now we're on to the second to last item that I picked out at Rue 21. And this one is gonna be something that I don't think I've ever featured here on my channel before because it just sort of became popular within the last year or so, I think. And that is the shacket <laughs> or the shirt jacket. Why they don't just call it a shirt jacket, I don't know. But the shacket has come to life and now it's here on my channel. And I'm all about it. Frankly, I really do enjoy it. So this is what it looks like. This is a denim jacket or shirt jacket. And I picked this up in a size 3X for $38.99. And I love the way this looks. So this is a very distressed shirt jacket. It goes down quite long and it has lots of distressing all the way down it. And I'm just all about this. I think it is so, so cool. And really and truly the options that you can wear these are endless. So you can wear this with a regular kind of a plain white V-neck t-shirt underneath it with some regular jeans and some kids that would look amazing. 
or you can wear it closed, like button it down all the way and wear it over some really cute leather leggings, some latex leggings or some matte leather leggings with some really cool Converse sneakers or some Doc Martens that would look so, so cool. And this is something that I think personally that I'm gonna get a lot of use from. This is something I could just throw on and walk out the door and not even think twice about it. It's just kind of lived in, it's worked in, it's quite a soft denim. I love the fact that it has two functional pockets right here in the front with the distressed silver buttons. And it also has like the ombre effect going up it so it's darker at the bottom and then softer, kind of lighter at the top. And this is just a very, very cool looking piece. It doesn't take a lot of thought. You throw it on, but it still looks like you're very cool, very casual, and I love it. All right, y'all, so now we're on to the final outfit of the entire day, and this one is going to be the most casual of the entire bunch. And I honestly think that they sent me the wrong top to go with these bottoms, but nonetheless, I'm still gonna wear the hell out of it. And I'll probably go on the website and purchase the separate top to go along with this as well. So I'm gonna talk about the bottoms first, and then I'll move on to the top. So this is what the bottoms look like. And this is loungewear that I am just, it is so soft, it's so comfortable. And I'm just gonna be living in this in the fall and winter time, I just know it. So this is what the pants look like. These are very nice drawstring, functional drawstring pants. And I'm not really sure if the color is coming across on camera. When I'm looking in my viewfinder right here in front of me, they look quite blue but in person they are very, very gray. So that's just something that I wanted to let y'all know. But when you go down the front of these, they have this very wonderful kind of a waffle style thermal material that is so freaking soft. It is so soft and comfortable, y'all. I could just live in this. And then when you go down to the bottom, it has this very nice sort of a tapered cuff. It just fits really nicely on the leg. Once again, it has a drawstring. It also has pockets. And I picked these up for $24.99. And let me tell you what the material is made of. So these are made of 85% polyester, 10% rayon, and 5% spandex. I also picked these up in a size 3X. They could not fit better. I love the way they fit. They're a little bit oversized, but that's exactly the way that I wanted to wear them. And then the shirt that I got to wear with these, I think they sent me the wrong color because I wanted it to match exactly with the pants, but nonetheless, I'm still gonna wear this because it's an inside garment anyway. So this is what the top looks like. This is a hooded top. I got this in a 4X, which is quite big and billowy. However, it is a crop top and I just love the way this looks with the pants. I wish it was the same color, but I'm just gonna buy the same color and just be done with it. But I picked this up for once again, $24.99. It does come in separates. So you do have to buy them separates. I got these, I think they were on sale whenever I ordered these. And anyway, this is what it looks like. And it sort of has this almost on camera, it looks like a subtle animal print, but it doesn't come across that in person. It just kind of looks like polka dots. Um, and also has that same waffling, so, so soft. I love the way this feels. It also has a very nice, very generously sized hood, which I appreciate with my big old head. And the material is made of 95% polyester, 5% spandex. And I also picked this up in a 4X. I think I mentioned that already, <laughs> but I'm not sure. And the sleeve also has that same tapering right there at the wrist, which I also really appreciate. And I just think that this looks really, really cool. It looks really easy. And I plan on wearing this for a movie night for, you know, on the chilly nights, whenever we're gonna have little bonfires and things, you can wear this outside with your little Crocs or whatever. And you can even wear this with jeans if you wanted to, it would look really cute with jeans. And I just love the way it looks. All right, y'all, that is going to do it for this Rue 21 denim and a graphics tee plus size try on haul. I hope y'all found this video helpful and enjoyable. If you did, please give it a like and a subscribe. You know your girl would appreciate it. As always, thank y'all so, so much for watching. I always appreciate each and every one of you. Please stay safe and stay healthy. I'm gonna be seeing y'all very, very soon. <laughs> Bye.